high school wrestling experience. I had just won a big match that put me in the semifinals of the States. I was so excited, but yet so anxious coming off the mat. I had never been in a venue so large like this in Atlantic City where thousands and thousands of people were. The reporter from the local newspaper was standing there waiting for me and said, Jared, can I get an interview? I said to him, I'll be right back. When I came back, I said to him, we can start the interview now. I just had to go to the bathroom. I had real bad diarrhea. You know, I was so nervous being in a big venue like this. I'd never competed like this before, but I'm ready to go now. Sure enough, the next morning, the headlines in the local paper said, Spencer's in the semis. And down below, it started off by saying, with diarrhea some, so badly that he had to postpone the post-match interview, he somehow overcame his nerves and won his big match. You can imagine being a high school athlete and returning to your school on Monday after having achieved the crowning moments of your athletic career, what your friends would really want to talk about. Did they care what I placed in states that year? Not at all. As friends would, all they cared about was that I was feeling better from my diarrhea. Thousands and thousands of fans knew about the diarrhea. I would hear things going down the hallway like when you're climbing up a ladder and you fall down here a splatter, diarrhea, ch -ch -ch, diarrhea. Ch -ch -ch -ch. Amazing, right? Here's the point. Don't get so caught up in sports. Whether or not you succeed or fail, at the end of the day, it's not really that important. It's really about your friendships and about having a good perspective on it. I had a good perspective, so when my friends were teasing me, I rolled with it. I laughed about it, and I got it. Because I realized early on in my life, there's far more to life than just sports. It's not all about that, and it shouldn't be. Keep a good perspective on where sports are in your life as well.